Hey everybody, this is my custom Lego Tron light cycle. I was gonna have a really fun custom Tron themed intro, but it got copyright struck, so here we are. So here we are, four years later. You may recall, you won't, back uh, four years ago on my channel, I did a, a Tron light cycle video. And um, it's it's very bad, both the build and the four 240p quality. So I wanted to bring that <laughs> design into the modern age. Especially because the old one was like white and off-colored a ton and get the right parts and really do it justice So now that we have the right uh, video quality experience and parts Let's get into my custom Lego Tron life cycle So what I can recall from this design which was four years ago, so bear with me I wanted the simplest and sleekest design I could using the least amount of parts But still making it a minifigure scale and B look good and after a, after a bit of revision from the old model, I think the old model stands the test of time, and I'll get into the actual views of said model. So here we just have a nice side view, so you can probably tell how I made these um, wheels, just, you know, the discs, and then having the other piece right there, and then it just clips right onto that pin down there. Pretty, uh, not rocket science there, but I'm, what I did change was I added a plate right here to add to the smoothness of the design, and I changed out, it used to be just a hole right here, and I put in the uh, neon blue bricks to simulate the engines, which are actually in the actual uh, movie, so the engines go there, and I think that was pretty nice, and then I added another tile down there to kind of make it smoothly transition to this um, steering wheel piece, which is just a droid, literally just a droid arm, a hinge, and in that, I would put a smooth tile on there, but it kind of hinders this from going all the way forward. And then, heading on to the back over here, we got just the where the light jets go, and that's kind of just cemented right there. I couldn't get it any more flush, any more smooth, so that's just where it is. But simply, you just put, you just slap that on, and you slap that on, and I think it looks pretty, it looks pretty alright for uh, for what it is. So now we're moving on in the front view, and there's not much to see in the front view. I didn't put headlights on there because whenever I built something, it just looked really bulky with the two lights, and if it's one light, it just doesn't look the same. So it's just, uh, again, adding less parts and improving the sleekness of the design. And that's basically it for this uh, this mock. It's just like the same on the, the other side. Go to the bottom, it's literally just a 2x3 holding this assembly together. So that concludes this uh, Tron light cycle. I was finally able to get the two cylinders and the uh, translucent pieces on Bricklink, and then I just built it. Which, it's honestly really gratifying to actually own one, or build one. Because it's, it's just one of the things I would always build as a, as a younger lad. And to finally have one that's like color coordinated and correct is something that I really do like. But I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you in the next one.